New this morning, KCATA is proposing some major changes to their current bus routes. Their plans could impact thousands of people who rely on public transportation to get to and from work each day. But they want to hear from you first. That's right, 41 Action News reporter Belinda Post joins us live from the bus stop in front of City Hall. Good morning. Good morning, Richard and Lindsay. In fact, I am at the bus stop across from City Hall. And if those changes went through by KCATA, this would no longer be a part of the Graham Boulevard line. It would actually be on the 25 Truist line. And that's not the only adjustment that the city is talking about making. There would actually be 19 changes. They say that that would help to improve efficiency. So let's take a look at some of the main streets that would see those changes. One would be the Truist route. It could now extend past 75th Street and turn on to Bannister, extending to Blue Ridge. Other changes have several options, like the 23rd Street route. The Transportation Authority is looking at three options to better connect the Kansas City Health Department and Truman Medical Center. That route roughly extends from Blue Valley Park to Crown Center. Now, as you guys mentioned, KCATA wants to know what you think about this overhaul. So you've got several chances to give your input. Tonight's the first meeting that'll be at the Waldo Public Library from 4 to 6 on East 75th Street. Now, if these changes are approved, these wouldn't go into effect until October. Reporting live from Kansas City, Belinda Post, 41 Action News today.